G'day guys, Grumpy Trev back again, and that glow's not be head, it's the sun, look. Anyway, back with another five minute bite of interview. review. I've got the Tyro 129, which is a seven inch quad. You've got to build it yourself. So when you do, this is what it looks like. So we're going to have a quick look at the parts, and then we're going to take this thing for a spin. Right, let's go. There you go guys, that's what you get in the box. Uh, very quickly, that's a top left hand side, it's a TPU holder for your run cam or a Session 5, Session 4, GoPro, um, decent set of Cyclone props, and uh, obviously the frame and a few Velcro straps. The flight controller is the Esheen GPS F4, and also the Esheen 4-in-1 40 amp Beer Holly S uh, 2-6S CSC. Comes with a set of decent motors, which are the uh, 2507 1800 KVs. Uh, they'll do 3-6X as well left and right hand or counterclockwise and clockwise motors the vtx uh 40 channels does 600 up to 600 milliwatt also has smart audio and also we have the cadex turbo f2 camera i didn't put this in uh, the build i did uh, i did have another camera i wanted to try out which is the uh foxy split so uh just so i think it's a decent footage but it's still a good camera it also comes with a gps which you can uh Assumingly, we flick a switch and it'll come back into your direction where you've got to regain control of it when it comes back and uh, hopefully all that works. So we'll see what happens. Well, look, there's a quick look at the parts list. This thing really come up really well. I was surprised how good it really come up. I didn't do a build video on it. I actually ran out of time to do it. And uh, But what I'll do, there's an old, another old guy, an old guy with a drone, as a matter of fact, uh, give a shout out to Mitch. Uh, I'll leave a link below. He's got a great build video there. Really easy to follow. Lay back and just follow your own leisure. So uh, it's worthwhile looking at. Anyway, let's get on with the uh, flight and see how it goes. Hey guys, Grubby Trev back again. Now we're gonna. I've got the Tyro 129. To give it a bit of a fly around today. Just finished building the thing. It's pretty well stock except for the camera. I did change that. Look, it comes with a good Cadex camera, but I've stuck the Fox here HD split in there. So uh, we're gonna give that a go and um, see how good this thing is. Let's go. All right, here we go with the uh, Toro 129. See how good this thing is. Ooh. Well, that surprises me. It's pretty smooth. Very smooth, in fact. Shit. Yeah, this is not bloody $129 quad. Oh. Well, there you go. They've done it again, these guys. This is bloody... This was flying really well. Like, it's not a race machine, but shit. Good filming platform. It's very stable. Look, for a 7-inch, it's pretty nippy as well. Surprisingly nippy. Yeah, you've got an old bloke like me flying it. If anyone can... I can do this, anyone can. But that's not what it's designed for. I guess it's a long range rig. Uh, it has got a GPS in it. A, uh, I'm just going to try it. Hopefully, it'll come back to me this time. Let's we'll see what happens. We're going to hit the GPS button now. Uh, no, fail safe. Boom. I just saw it land. Maybe I've got something set up wrong there. Can you take off from there? I uh, should be able to arm it again. Let's see. Well, guys, look, for 129 bucks, I reckon it's great. Uh, as long as you uh, set up GPS mode, okay. I will do another video on that um, just to get it right for my sake as yours as well. But uh, it does fly right for 129 bucks. You can't go wrong. It's got some great stuff in it. You get some decent props. You do get a Cadex, not the one that comes with it, because that is the uh, box here in there, as I said. But uh, if you're after a seven inch and you want to build it yourself, uh, I'll just, I reckon it's cheap. Anyway, I'll leave a link below if you're interested. And give us a thumbs up if you like the video. If you don't like the video, you know what? No, I won't say it. I'll be nice today. Catch you guys.